Hello everyone. Hope you're doing well. Welcome to the fourth topic in our video series where we will focus on something that's very important for research but often gets overlooked, the review of literature or RL for short. So, what exactly is a review of literature? Imagine you're putting together a puzzle, but before you start, you need to see the picture on the box. That's exactly what the RL does. It shows you the big picture of what's already known about your research. It's like gathering all the pieces to know where your work fits in. Now, you might be wondering, why do I need to bother with this? Well, first, it gives your research some solid ground to stand on. It also helps you spot what's missing in the current studies. Those are your opportunities to make a real contribution. Just, it can sharpen your research focus so you're asking the right questions. Getting started with the literature review isn't as scary as it sounds. First off, Lock down your research cushion. That's your starting point. Now, you're going to dive into some research databases like PubMed, Google Scholar, etc. to find studies related to your topic. Once you've got your sources, take a good look at them. What are the common themes? What are the debates? Finally, piece it all together in a way that supports your research. Remember, stay focused on your research cushion. Be critical. Don't just summarize the studies, evaluate them. And lastly, be systematic in your approach. This makes your review more reliable and thorough. Remember, a strong literature review is your research's best friend. It backs up your work and shows you are on the right path. Thanks for watching this video. In the next week, we shall look more on how to do a literature review. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach us out at SRQC. Mm -hmm.